hey guys welcome back to the garden welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Blanca so today's video just a quick update and see what is happening with my vanilla so um yeah you guys were as excited as I am to see how this vanilla progresses a lot of you guys just like me have never seen the flowers in person so I'm excited to share with you guys the process and um how you know it, it you know it blooms and and all of that so today i have my ladder my husband's gonna come <laughs> he's right there my husband's gonna come and hold it for me um so i can show you guys a closer look on what the buds look like so for those that were like me that had lost lo hope on this on this beautiful vanilla orchid you know there is hope and i can't believe it um you know it it, it it took me by surprise i had no idea i was getting buds and it was just such a great just a great day what do you have for me thank you Hi. thank you Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay babe so hold the ladder for me i'm gonna just uh, climb it and show them the buds um so yeah so uh for you guys that had lost hope there's hope uh, if they bloom for me, I'm sure it'll bloom for you. So I have it. That's easy. I'll hold the ladder. Um, not going to go up too high just because there's some buds right here. So I keep it um, on this Christmas palm, which I've had it here for the last four years. I did, um, I did attach it um, October. I found the video, which I attached to my last video. <laughs> my grandson is very vocal this morning. Uh, attached it to my last video, which um, was in October of 2019. I purchased her from a local grower, Quest Orchids. Um, and I've had her on this Christmas palm since then. So she, the Christmas palm is, the orchid is kind of south facing. Uh, it does get morning sun and afternoon sun. It does very well out, out here. So as you can see, getting blooms. Uh, so I, I believe this is, you know, she's happy. Leaves kind of like grow downwards. She is such a pretty orchid. Now this one here is creating another vine. And that's not where the, the blooms came from. That's one of the things I was worried about. They had told me that um, unless it, it just bushes up or comes down again, it's not going to bloom. But as you can see, there's nothing else. <laughs> What's going on? Hold on. Is, what's going on down there? <laughs> He's holding on to the ladder. He's so vocal this morning. So, let's see. Look at that. Look at what the buds look like. I had never seen them in person. I'm happy that I'm able to share this with you guys. And these blooms, or these buds are a little bit higher up. And then those two. So I did confirm there are four clusters growing. See, there's one here. There's one there. There's one here. And there's one right there. So the good thing about this is that probably the ones, well, not probably, but these are, these here will um, start flowering first, that cluster. And then this cluster here, and then the ones lower are going to be the last to to bloom. Uh, I did read; I did a lot of research, so I did read that it'll um, this orchid will probably continue uh, just flowering for the next two months. So I might get more clusters, which I am hoping for because a flower only lasts for a day. Now, being that the flower only lasts for a day gets me a little bit nervous because I do have to go to work every day, and on the weekends I have. I have orchid shows or I have um, other shows um, at schools that, I, that I'm also a vendor at. So I hope that she blooms sometimes. I'm going back down. I hope that, oh, hi, brother. Hi, son. <laughs> hi, uncle. <laughs> I do hope that um, she blooms when, when I am home to be able to pollinate her because you guys did convince me. And I am going to to try to pollinate. So I'm 
Look at that. Um, I will. I would love to pollinate. Good morning. Good morning. Did you see this? Yeah. So this is my son. If you guys remember him <laughs> from other videos. So this orchid up here is called the vanilla orchid. It had never bloomed ever in four years. And look at this. Look at my camera so I can show you. You see this? You see that? You see that right there? Mm -hmm. Those are um, those are buds that are forming. And then the flower comes. And this is where the vanilla extract comes from. The vanilla you use for, for, for desserts and all that and to cook. Mm -hmm. So I am going to try to pollinate it. And, and you can... It. So you can only pollinate the flower when it's in bloom. And guess what? The nope. flower only blooms for a day. So you only, you only have today to pollinate it? Well, not today. It hasn't bloomed yet. So when it blooms, I need you guys to help me too. Like keep an eye on it. When the flower comes out, that's the only day that I can come out here like with a paintbrush or with a toothpick and, um, and pollinate it. And then we can get vanilla bean and then you put it inside like bourbon or vodka or some mm. type of alcohol for six months and you make the vanilla extract. I read all that. You think you're going to want to help me with that? <laughs> Just keep an eye on this and let me know when it when it blooms. Stare at it. Mm. Yeah. Come out here every morning. <laughs> that worked. <laughs> just just messing with him um so yeah you guys very excited about this i do want to share with you guys the process of how this is done so yeah hoping that the flowers don't bloom when i'm not home to be able to come out here and pollinate and then share with you guys you know what happens and hopefully it catches and and all of that so this was today's video just an update on my vanilla and Oh, and um, I also got some questions about my Birds of Paradise. It is indeed in bloom also. I see, I guess that's why they call it Birds of Paradise because this, where the flower is going to come out from, I believe this is it. It kind of looks like a bird. That looks like the beak there, so. And that's never happened before either. So lots of good things happening in the garden. And then I saw these buds which is also super exciting for me. This cat Leia is going to open with three flowers. Can't wait for that. My, my green golf pig is still, is still in bloom there. And that's it, you guys. This was today's quick garden update. Family's all out here. It's pretty early. Everybody's getting ready to go to work. I need to get to work so so that's it it is Thursday tomorrow I will start um, setting up at the Wellington show can't wait can't wait to see what orchids they have over there I still got my orchids under my my terrace which I need to mount so hopefully tomorrow morning before I leave I can I can get that done and that's it just a peaceful hey baby just a peaceful walk out here and i get to hang out with him for a little bit before i go to work so thank you guys for watching i will keep you posted hope everyone is having a great day and i will see you soon in my next video bye bye